Well, Don, it may be more of a cover for defense because you're right. The health department does plan to have high school fall sports this semester, but they want to make sure they have the entire field covered to try to prevent the spread of the coronavirus. It's game on for high school sports in Butte this fall, but there are some restrictions due to the coronavirus. We are not allowing um, any uh, spectators from the away team. No concessions, no band. We're trying to keep that crowd size limited. Players will only be allowed to invite two spectators per home game. And many of the social distancing enforcement will be the responsibility of coaches and athletic directors. Um, everybody will be in a mask. Um, except for the individuals on the field. That would include players and refs. The health department will continue monitoring the situation and sporting events could be canceled depending on the spread of the virus. If one offensive lineman comes out positive, we have to put our contact tracing into operation and that could wipe out a whole front line and there, there goes your team. The health department adds that it's going to be up to the players, coaches, and fans to be responsible and safe in order for the games to continue this fall. I love watching Butte High and Butte Central com compete. I get it. Um, but at the end of the day, we are in a global pandemic. This is real. It's not a hoax. Um, I have the proof. and. Um, um, I'm hoping that people are, are wearing masks to do everything they can to help us mitigate it. And these fall sports will include, of course, football, volleyball, soccer, and track. And that's a story from Butte. Reporting live, John Amy, back to you.